Now I want to talk to you about how to disable the traffic option on a Garmin GPS. Now we currently do not have that option turned on and I'll show you why. If you go under settings, this is a Garmin Newbie 2595 LMT model. If you scroll down here in the settings, you find traffic, traffic mode and providers. Go ahead and click on that. And as you can see, we have not turned on our, or enabled our traffic receiver or our traffic because it says the traffic receiver cable is required. Now what they're talking about is the cigarette adapter. Cigarette lighter adapter or the power adapter that plugs into the back of the Garmin GPS and by a mini, uh, mini USB cable. And when you do this and power it on in the car, it actually acts as an antenna and receives those traffic updates for you. So currently, we are not receiving any traffic updates because we are indoors and it is not plugged into our, uh, our car power and uh, no other cord will work for this. But had we had this turned on, see when we go to click it and turn it on, it just tells us to plug in the cable, which we cannot do because we're currently not in the automobile. Uh, but once it's turned on, plugged in and turned on, it will tell you your current provider, any subscriptions that you have, which, uh, which providers you've subscribed to, and it will give you traffic updates. So if you go back to the main menu, let me show you where it is, or if you go onto the map, this little icon right here with the double vehicles and its little circle will normally be highlighted green if the traffic is currently turned on and you'd be able to click on that and get traffic updates. And as, as you can see, it's telling us to plug in the cable. Again, we're talking about the power adapter for the car because again, there's a built-in antenna into that cable that, that uh, powers that traffic option. Now there is a way to not only, so, so if you want to turn it off, which is actually the question, uh, you go under settings like I said, go to traffic and then just uncheck mark it from there. You should be able to uncheck mark it. Or simply unplug your cable and it will turn off. Now if you actually want to delete the icon from the, from the map, you go back, scroll up to map and vehicle, and this will give you some map options, okay? You're going to scroll down and you're going to go at map buttons, adds buttons to the map. And this shows the three buttons over here that you have, and you can go ahead, and I'm not going to go ahead because I, I'm not going to delete it because I want it, but you just click on the little red X, and it would ask you to say, after you delete it, it would ask you to save, and then you go on from there. But I'm going to go ahead and keep it on mine because I like having the traffic updates, so I'm going to cancel. But that's how you turn off the traffic updates, or traffic, uh, uh, the traffic option, as well as delete the button if you really, really will, if you really want to get rid of those traffic uh, updates. Mm -hmm.